Hello everyone. Welcome to Study Desk. Today we are going to talk about Chapter One: Real Numbers, Class Ten from NCERT. Let's go through the introduction. So, positive integers, negative integers, irrational numbers, and fractions are all examples of real numbers. In other words, we can say any number is a real number except complex numbers. Now, what are complex numbers? So, the numbers where you are writing the square root of a negative number. For example, square root of minus fifteen that is considered as a complex number. Some examples of real numbers include one, one by two, one point seven five, root two, and so on. Any real number can be plotted on the number line. Now let's discuss classification of real numbers. Real numbers can be further classified as rational numbers and irrational numbers. So it is the union of rational numbers and irrational numbers. For example. we can say rational numbers are the numbers which can be written as in the form of p by q where q should not be equal to 0 if you are writing a number in the form of numerator upon denominator and the denominator is never equal to 0 we will call such numbers as rational numbers for example 3 upon 4 minus 1 upon 2 7 upon 3 these all are considered as rational numbers and examples of irrational numbers are the numbers which cannot be written in the form of p by q okay where denominator is not equal to 0 these kind of numbers are called as irrational numbers you cannot write down in the form of p by q for example root of all prime numbers you can say root of 2 that is an irrational number root of 3 root of 5 or you can say pi pi is also an irrational number now rational numbers is basically the union of non integer numbers and integers Now, what are non-integer numbers? So, the numbers where you have decimal expansion. For example, zero point seven, right? Zero point three two, zero point five. They all have decimal expansion, so they are called as non-integer numbers. Whereas, integer numbers are the numbers where it is a combination of negative numbers, zero, and positive numbers. So, you can say minus one, zero, one. They all are the examples of integers. Now, what are integers? A combination of it is basically collection of negative numbers along with the whole numbers. So, negative numbers you can consider it as minus one, minus two, minus three. These all are the examples of negative numbers. Now, talking about whole numbers, so the numbers are starting from zero onwards, zero, one, two, three. They all are whole numbers. Some examples of that include zero, one, or you can say hundred also. So, these are the examples of whole numbers. now whole numbers basically constitute zero as well as all the natural numbers so zero along with all the natural numbers what are natural numbers basically they are counting numbers so they will start from one onwards 1 2 3 4 so on okay so some examples of natural numbers include 1 2 99 they all are examples of natural numbers okay thank you so much